Good morning, Webster Grove Statesman, and welcome to your announcements for Wednesday, August 25th. Just another reminder that the coffee shop is back. It will be open before school until 10 a.m. every day. And bus passes are available starting today. Your bus drivers will not be checking throughout the week and Monday, but starting on Tuesday, they'll begin checking for bus passes. So make sure you swing by Office 308 to grab your bus pass. Lunch schedules explained. Lunch is based on fourth period most days, but on B days, it will be based on fifth period. So that is today, which means that your lunch schedule today may not be the same as it was or is the rest of the week. If you're in a PE, math, IT, science, facts, fine arts, business, or act lab, you'll go to first lunch. However, if you're in social studies, world language, English, SSD, or makerspace, you have second lunch today. If you're still uncertain, just head to your class and see where your classmates are. Remember that juniors as well as seniors can leave for lunch. You must return with your ID or SAS pulled up on your phone at the junior or Roberts gym entrance. Masks must be worn when you're not eating. Students can no longer eat in teachers' classrooms. Students can, however, eat in the courtyard, commons, cafeteria, or Roberts gym. If you bring your lunch, we ask that you eat in Roberts gym to help with social distancing. You may eat in any place, but once you're there, stay there. Every student is eligible for free lunch this year. All food on the larger side of the cafeteria. Please do not move chairs. They must stay as they are set up. Admins will release all students for l- from lunch. Please remain seated until that time. If you're interested in the Fall Art Apprenticeship Program, which is a 12-week program from September 14th to December 11th that will take place at the St. Louis Artworks on Del Mar Boulevard, then you need to apply today. I'll include a link in the video description. Are you interested in history or politics? This club, History in Action, is meeting the last Thursday of each month starting this Thursday, so tomorrow, in room 290 at 8 a.m., so before classes. Also, if you're interested in joining the STEP team, come by room 252 this Thursday after class at 345 or contact Ms. Jordan for more information. And don't forget about the Selma Street Dance this Friday from 7 to 9. It's a dollar for students. There'll be outdoor games and dancing, as well as a visit by the Kona Ice Truck. Art Club will be returning after school on Tuesdays, starting next Tuesday. And Yearbook Club will also be next Tuesday at 3.30 in room 196. If you can't make it, email Miss Reese for more information. And that's it. Have a wonderful rest of your day, statesmen.